now we will discuss Rosenmund reduction and Stefan reduction one by one. Uh, these two are the name reactions, uh, and both of them are used for the preparation of aldehydes. Okay. First, let's discuss Rosenmund reduction, and this is actually in this reaction, acyl chlorides, that is acid chlorides, are hydrogenated or reduced with the help of Caladium, uh, a catalyst like palladium or barium sulfate to form aldehydes. Like for an example, if I use this compound, name of which is yes, it is benzoyl chloride, and this is hydrogenated using hydrogen and uh, palladium which is poisoned with BASO4 okay now why poison it is just to limit uh, or to control the reduction okay BASO4 here act as a poison poison is something which limit or reduced the activity of a catalyst so here the use of palladium and hydrogen is to carry out reduction and BASO4 used to limit that reduction okay otherwise it will give directly hydrocarbons so when we do this this Cl comes out and what we get is CHO the compound is benzaldehyde so this reaction can be used in case we want to convert a carboxylic acid into uh, alcohol uh, into aldehyde for example if i have uh, ch3 cooh ethanoic acid i react this with pcl5 to form ch3 cocl and then i reduce it using hydrogen in presence of palladium poisoned with BASO4 then I'll be getting CH3 CHO fine another is Stefan reaction another name reaction and these and in this reaction uh, nitriles which are also known as cyanides are reduced to corresponding imines with the help of stannous chloride in the presence of hydrochloric acid and these imines on hydrolysis gives aldehyde so basically uh, if I start with RCN and then I use stannous chloride SNCl2 in presence of HCl then I'll be getting an imine RCH double bond N H. Now this is a reduction. Why is this a reduction? Because in cyanide there was carbon triple bond nitrogen. One hydrogen is added to carbon, another hydrogen is added to nitrogen to form R CH double bond CH. Now this imine on hydrolysis gives aldehyde. Okay, so this was the Stefan reaction. But apart from SNCl2, I can also use another reagent, a di iso butyl aluminium hydride, which in short known as dibel. Uh, and it is represented like ALH or more accurately it is ALH I B U whole twice. Now but now there is an advantage of using this dibel over SNCL2 that the advantage is if I use R CH double bond CH CN and I reduce it using dibel. followed by hydrolysis then 
it would be a selective reduction selective reduction means the double bond will not be affected and, uh, and it will remain as such and only the cyanide would be converted into CH double bond NH which on hydrolysis will give me R CH double bond CH CH O fine so using dibel in this reaction would give us advantage that if there is an unsaturation that will not be affected in the same way if rather than amine I use any ester that can also be reduced using dibel followed by hydrolysis to give our CHO aldehyde I hope these two reactions were clear to you these are the name reactions which are used for the preparation of aldehyde stay tuned for more videos of organic, inorganic and physical chemistry and don't forget to subscribe thank you